Hai. Gue. Guys, we are here. This is called J Ice Cream. It's a spot, uh, ice cream spot in Kasese town. If you want some ice cream, you can come and chill here. But also, it's uh, our, always our departure spot. So every time we go to hike with Kasese Hikers Club, this is where we start our journey. So right now, guys, it's um, eight in the morning. So. We are going to start a hike. We are still waiting for other people. As you can see, the van is there waiting for us to go and see the woods to go and hike, guys. So very soon we are going to set off. But uh, right here, we, we, we can you can be like taking coffee. If you want morning ice cream. I've never tasted ice cream very early in the morning. Maybe one time I can uh, have an experience of how morning ice cream tastes. It's so, alright guys. So we are ready. Check my boots ready to go to the woods again. Very ready to go to the woods guys. Alright. See you soon. People are coming. I've started to come. Very soon in a few minutes we are leaving. And our van is right there waiting for us. Alright. Let's hit the woods. Let's hit the woods guys very ready for this let's hit the woods My name is Dan. I'm also a hiker. I'm missing the naturals. So here, basically, we demonstrate to you a force caused by the Earth's rotation. It's called the Coriolis effect. So Coriolis was a French man. He's the one who discovered this. So he said objects are attached to the Earth's surface, like hurricanes, giant storms when they are rotating. In the northern hemisphere, they rotate anti-clockwise. But here now, the water is not attached to the Earth's surface. It spins clockwise in the northern hemisphere. Why? Because objects in the north are normally deflected to the right, hence they turn clockwise. So this is not the only experiment that shows you the arc spins. In another one, they use a pendulum. It's also named after French. Leg bites, scorpion bites, and good for you high cars. Why do you yes, preserve a dead one? They bite you there, and so this can be a remedy. Hmm? Why do you preserve a dead one? Yeah, it's like a moving. It's our moving museum. So you're welcome to the center of the earth. So this line was first discovered 1700 years back. There were Frenchmen in Ecuador. Ecuador is the Spanish word for equator. So their country is equator. It produced Colombia, Brazil, Africa, San Tome and Prince Pe Gabon, Congo Brazzaville, DRC, Congo, Uganda, Kenya, Somalia, Asia, Maldives, Kiribati, Singapore, Indonesia, Malaysia. The distance is 477 kilometers. You stand here on the equinox day noon time, you won't see your shadow. The sun will be right on your head. It happens 21st of March and 23rd September. Still on the line, you are lighter. Your one kg is off. To centrifugal forces. The reason it does not rotate is the same reason Uganda is never hit by tornadoes. 
cyclones, hurricanes, they never cross the equator. Wow. They take to the right, to the left, they come down at the equator. So thank God you were born in the Pearl of Africa. Thank you. Wow. <laughs> thank you, Dan. You're welcome. Thank you. At the equator, you can have a view of Queen Elizabeth National Park. Yes, and the guys are there. So when you come here at the equator, you can have a picture at uh, Queen Elizabeth National Park, a monument. And then you can also have a picture at uh, the equator point, line, the equator line. And also there is that person who has the knowledge on uh, about the equator line and he can also explain in details all right let's go and hike guys we just had a stopover just for the equator to get the knowledge because we took the route that we are taking it passes through the equator all right so guys uh this town is called charumba charumba in Lukonzo. uh this is where you can find a river that river is called river Nyamwasani, like Nyamgasani, if you want to pronounce it in, in English but if you're pronouncing it in Lukonzo it's called Nyamwasani but of course guys um, you see up there that was a town like grab watch hey Okay, I got to cause a search. <laughs> so, guys, uh, that used to be a town, Charumba town, but all that place, you see all those stones, it, they used to be houses. Actually, there's even a foundation. Oh, there is even a foundation like to show like these were houses. All these were houses, but they were swept away by the aggressive Nyamugasani. And people here relocated but I see some people still stay it but are still on a risk and yes that's that's Nyamgasani River and the view is amazing what's in the hole yeah the view is amazing so all those are Renzori ranches and we are going up there so the falls are up up there all right so all this is Kasese guys I don't know if I shall get time and come and do a complete vlog for this village but let's pray that maybe one day I shall come officially to vlog this village and then we meet people we share we interact but today it is just a stopover Sharon over there at Lamara Travers <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> but so the hills here are amazing. Actually, when I'm in this town, I love the views because the whole town is surrounded by nature. You can really feel the hills, like you see the hills. You enjoy the whole town is surrounded with nature. All right, this is Charumba Town for you. Actually, welcome to today's vlog. We are going for a hike, but currently we have just got a stopover here in Charumba Town. So behind me is uh, Charumba Town, but this uh, then this side is called no, it's not bad. It's not bad. is called Musasa. This side is called Musasa, and this is Nyamugasani River. We are just having a stopover, but we are going up there. We are going up there to twin waterfalls locally known as uh, Nyabahasa Falls share this video I'm called Glazio Janet from Glazio Adventures so guys we are now at the spot where we're going to start walking so yeah you're there so right now we are at the spot where we have stopped to walk the car and we are going to park our car and then we start hiking this village is called Muanza this is the town if you have uh, if you don't have a four-wheel car this is where you can stop and then you start the hike but if you have a four-wheel car you can continue up to the next center called Kalitusim all right 
Let's go! Everybody get ready for the hike! We go, we go, we go! So guys, finally we are going to walk. We are going to hike. Okay, <laughs> 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 Hi guys, we are already in uh, the village. The village is called Mutere. That's what the, the uh, women have told me. Guys, they're just coming from the hospital. They are having carrying a baby. <laughs> they're even carrying a baby, guys. Congratulations to those mothers. They have had another president of Chile. So we are going to hike. We are going to hike, guys. We are close to the waterfalls. Just a few minutes and we will be there. If it's your first time, please kindly subscribe. I'm called Glasio Janet. And guys, get, watch the view. Amazing view. Very beautiful view. You see, guys, what I'm talking about when I say nature, that's it. That's what I always talk about when I say nature. Mama, yes, there, we know we're having a <laughs> <laughs> For me, I prefer, I really prefer uh, hiking so fast, so that's my challenge. And so I always, sometimes I leave people behind, but I have always, I always want to wait for everyone. But of course, when we are a group, sometimes it's hard to wait for everyone. You need to push harder so that they also push more. No. <laughs> All right, guys. So we are taking, we are hydrating right now. We are hydrating, and then we continue. Now we, and then we reach the falls. So let's wait for all the other guys, and then we go to the falls. It's raining again. It's raining because we are now on a higher. We are now at the higher elevation, so we expect the weather to change any time. And God is blessing us with the anointing oil. So anointing water now. All right. See you later when I'm swimming.
The, the speed of this water can do something amazing maybe rafting i don't know people have experience in rafting can this speed do rafting in here a main fall so this one here is uh, from another river and then this one here is from nyamgasani river all right guys so here we go it's raining it's raining it's raining I'm trying guys, bear with us, otherwise it's raining.